What is going on guys, today we are looking at Summer Stars Isaac, the 95 striker. He recently got himself a 92 team of the season and now we have got a 95 version of him. Again, a very impressive, uh, I think young lad here, yeah, 99. Wow, God, he's, he is young. What does that make him? 20, is he 22 now? No, 21 at the moment, I believe. 22 in September. Honestly, what a fantastic star this guy has been. He genuinely is eyeing up a good move at some point if he continues with it. The Sweden international is a four star five star high low standing at a whopping six foot four which is incredible he was already a four star five star before this i know that um, kimmich got an upgrade on his skill moves so i was seeing if he did get the same we've got outside of the foot shot the cat is meowing in the background but we keep moving 95 pace I don't even know why this guy put a hunter on him, in fact. He definitely doesn't need a hunter. He needs an engine. Let's see what an engine does on him. Let's have a look. Because a hunter, I just... I don't even know why you'd want that, to be honest. Unless you want to max it out completely. I just don't see the point in it. There we go. That's much better. So we do have 99 pace, 93 passing, and 98 dribbling. Obviously maxes out his agility balance. His shooting is already pretty up there. Like, you can't get much better. I don't quite get why you'd want a hunter. I don't understand why you'd want a hunter to be honest, but we've gone with the engine. Obviously, he's got his physicals. The strength is pretty impressive. Heading, stamina, jumping. Literally, the stats for this card is fantastic. The only thing that gets me worried with a card like this is his height. Six foot four is a big, big striker, and whether that takes away from the kind of agility side of him, we will have to wait and see. I can't remember what his team of the season was like. I'm pretty sure it was a objective. It was an objective. It was even an objective or an SBC. I believe an objective. So I cannot remember actually getting him. But we'll try out Isaac now, see what he's all about, and hopefully get a big dub from him. Lovely footwork from Isaac himself. Puts in a bit of Nedved. Back to him. This guy is absolutely on him. And yes, Isaac's agility is most definitely not compromised. There it is. Oh, off the line. What a strike. Great defender. Great agility from him, to be honest. Isaac's through. Goes for the... Ah, went for the near post, but didn't quite work out. Isaac finding in a bit of Nedved. Finds him back, but it's a great block from Edison. Isaac's going to be that absolute hunter. That's got to be a penalty. I'd say that's probably a red card. Mm, yeah, maybe not a red card, but I was... Oh, it's not even a penalty. Okay, what's Isaac? Laporte's got nothing. Isaac looks like... Okay, he's got nothing either. Oh, in fact, he's got a lot of power. What do we reckon? Right foot, bottom corner. There it is. Let's have a go. Oh, keeper moves over to the right then. That's a beautiful power shot right there. Maybe doesn't have the most free kicks, but we're hopefully going to see him have a little shot soon. I'm going to try and find it into him. He's dancing around the box. There he is. Get that turn. It's beautiful agility. That is a striker's finish right there. It's that turn. Look at that. That is a strike and a half. Honestly, what a beautiful turn. I thought the agility would be absolutely shot on him. Or at least not as prolific as he has been. Very, very quick on that left stick dribble. And it seems the slower he goes, the better that turn is. So that's always nice. That little kind of just turn around is absolutely stunning from him. And especially seeing as though he does have that five star uh, weak foot. You really can't argue. That's a great. There it is. One more. Ah, good tackle. But literally, that, that left foot is an absolute sweet spot there. Whew, try and get it past Kaylor again. Doesn't manage to get enough power on that one. But honestly, fantastic striker so far. There it is. Oh, that's poor. I didn't get it out of my feet. Thought he may have been able to take a touch before getting that shot. Into Isaac again. Lights have gone off. Initiating lights. Ah, oh, we went for the shot. I wanted the through ball. Isaac. Coming in with that interception. Oh, and you love the skills. Just a little simple left stick around the world. A little one-two. Oh, that's stunning. 
Oh, and he's going to go with his left foot. And again, burying it across goal. Literally, I think we've scored only with his left foot, which is obviously his weak foot. Obviously showing that that five-star weak foot is coming into good use right now. Especially seeing as I've put him on his side that really should be his stronger side, which just seems to be the weaker side at the moment. Look at that through ball. Can we get a little touch? Nearly. The big advantage that Isaac's going to have with this agility, especially in the balance as well, is that he is so big that the strength is going to carry him through as well. So that's a very, very nice little trait to have. And sometimes it's always nice to potentially have a bigger, stronger striker. Isaac gets the hat trick. You love to see it from him. Absolutely clinical finishing from him. Isaac. Seeing him in. Is he onside? I think he is. Oh, we nearly get it to the outside for him. Roberto Carlos. Oh, good strike from Isaac. Oh, Isaac again going for it from far out. Oh, Isaac running through. Doesn't manage to make the goal against Courtois, but definitely puts up a good shot. As we go for the header, but and luckily, Hanoin goes for it, and he decides that he doesn't want him to head it. Oh, Isaac, getting the foul there. Lovely stuff. Managing to really put the uh, burners on. Casemiro's definitely not got the acceleration to turn and sprint with him. So he has to bring him down. Oh, again, Courtois making an absolute lovely save. Uh, Isaac's not going to be able to jump higher than the keeper's fist. That's a stunning ball into Isaac couple of step overs can we get the little inside and the finesse easy as that that is what isaac does and he does it effortlessly so going into isaac's overall review then he is lovely striker i thought maybe the agility balance might not be all of that and i thought you may find himself a little bit stocky a little bit sometimes a bit harder to kind of move around complete opposite fast he's got a lovely dribble on him yeah so of course in, in comparison to like a five foot nine player they're going to talk they're going to turn i don't even know if it's milliseconds but they're going to turn a little bit quicker in terms of what isaac can do being six four is fantastic he's got a great shot on him left foot right foot was absolutely outstanding he's got the head he's got the strength overall a fantastic card right here yes obviously sweden not the greatest nationality to link with but La Liga, plenty. If we do look at Sweden, actually, I bet they've got a few nice cards. I know they've got Lindelof, Forsberg. Is it Eliasson? I want to say, is that you pronounce his name? Then you've got Kl Kluvleski. Oh, God, no. I can just feel Swedish people typing already. But, like, Forsberg is definitely one of my favorites. Really, really good card. Um, obviously, then linking up to Isaac, you've got Larsson you could go with. Actually, to be fair to them, I will take that back. There is a few decent players that you can actually link with. I forgot that this, um, the Sweden nationality got, obviously, that free player SBC. So, realistically, you do actually have some good players to link him with. I'd be interested to try what it's like with Larsson, to be honest. But, overall, I was very, very happy with him. He is, like I say, 21 years old. So in terms of generation, this is the, the biggest card for him so far. Like literally an 84 last year. He absolutely slapped it this year. Managing to get an 86, a 92 and a 95. Can we see him go any higher? He is dubbed a very, very good young star. Hopefully does continue. And he has been Isaac's Summer Stars review. He's coming in at an overall of... 9.4. See you for the next one. Like, subscribe. Peace.